Let's say that we have to draw this figure in front of us. Okay. Since our dimensions are millimeters, as we can see there, okay. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go new there and go metric standards millimeters and then we go create. And then here we're gonna go for our drawing. So we're gonna start with the rectangle, which is the base. Okay, so we're gonna start here. This rectangle and that rectangle <clears throat> the whole thing here so from there to there that one needs to be 12 millimeters okay and uh, from here to there we need to have <clears throat> 12 millimeters there and uh, this whole thing need to be 56 five, six millimeters okay and uh, this need to be five five millimeters <clears throat> great once we have that we're gonna go for the small part here this one what we're gonna do is we're gonna draw a small rectangle here okay and after that we're going to draw these lines oh we can just give the dimensions so this one here is 25 millimeters so from there to there that is 25 millimeters so Two five, so two five. Yeah, and we can draw the axis here. Okay, the axis of this hole. Okay, this one here. All right. Escape, and then we're going to go for this. So from there, sorry, not this one yet. So from there to there, we have it there, and then we have a straight line there. Then we have another one there, okay? As we can see on this figure, okay. So this one here, from there to there, that need to be 36, okay? 36, and this one need to be seven millimeters, seven, okay? From here to there, we need to have 11 millimeters, 11. And from there, from there to there, that one needs to be 100. 100. Okay. From here to here, that one needs to be 63, 63 millimeters. Great. <coughs> Once we have that in place, we're gonna draw a small rectangle inside there. You're gonna know what this is afterwards. Okay. So once we have that, we're going now to go for this. We're gonna go in 3D model now. We need to go there. I think everything is run. 3D model. We go with revolve. So we're gonna come here. We're gonna want to revolve this section. That one. Okay against this axis great okay okay after that we're gonna see uh, sketch visibility on okay then we're gonna go in 3d model again <coughs> extrude we're going to extrude this part that part and this one by uh, 12 millimeters okay 12 millimeters both side of the axis one two okay okay then we're going to extrude as well this part here this one now this time by 75 millimeters so seven five there you go okay like that then we say okay right so that one is there so we need to edit our sketch we need to make sure about the so edit sketch this one here need to be from there to there that's one need to be 15. don't worry about it it's gonna be okay then you say finish sketch okay so we have it that way okay then we're gonna come here to draw these two holes these ones 
<coughs> I'm gonna click there. I say new sketch. <coughs> then I'm gonna draw that one and this one. So from here to there, this one needs to be 45, 45. Okay, and uh, from here to there, that needs to be 28, so 28, 28, the same apply here, 28 days, so 28, okay, and uh, those need to be 12 millimeters, so 12, 1, 2, as well, those need to be 12, 1, 2. Great. What we're gonna do now? We're gonna go on 3D model. We click on extrude. So we're gonna click this part. That's one. And that's one. We can see this, and then we do this. Okay. So if we can check, this is what we're gonna have. We're gonna have afterward. Okay. Uh, sketch visibility off. This is now how your drawing looks like. Okay. So what you're gonna do next? is to choose the material next to finish drawing so you can go from stainless steel okay there you go or if you want something shiny maybe you can go for gold what is gold here mm, here is gold okay it was a pleasure of mine sharing this with you for you i hope that you enjoyed it i hope that you're gonna enjoy it for now i'm gonna ask you to take care of yourself Please don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to share, take care of yourself, don't forget to like as well. Bye.